Hey guys, the thing that's on my mind this morning is what the heck does free really mean? <laughs> and the reason why I'm thinking about this is I've gotten so many emails offering me all kinds of free things. Well, I have to give them my email address in order to get the fancy free thing. And to me, that is a value exchange. That's not free. My email is worth something. I mean, if you go and listen to any entrepreneur who's building their email list, you'll hear them say that those emails are high value. So I don't feel like if I have to give my email to someone in order to get something, I really got something for free. And I was thinking about that as I was rolling out the Sparkle and Rise January edition of our magazine, because the intent is really to get it in the hands of people for free. So I was running some Facebook ads and at first I did the typical thing where you ask for the email address and it just didn't feel right. And I was talking with a good friend of mine and she said, mm, if I have to give my email address, it's kind of not free. And it really resonated with me. So I changed the ads. I started getting a ton more attention and some of the women who read the magazine wanted to be on the email list so they didn't miss an issue going forward and they signed up on their own. That's fantastic. That's a choice. But the magazine wouldn't have really been free if I would have required an email in order for the person to get it. I'm just not a big fan of getting on a bunch of email lists and I feel like this has gotten worse and worse with the current, you know, COVID lockdown situation because listen, entrepreneurs are struggling and we're trying to pivot. I would just really encourage you if you have a free offer, make sure that it's really free and think about how you can serve your audience in a way that they'll sign up for your products, your services, your email list, if that's something that they're interested in. So I'll pop a link to the Sparkle and Rise magazine below. Um, it really is free. You can just click on the link and get it. And I'd love to hear your thoughts about what free means to you whether you are an entrepreneur who has a free product or service or someone who's consuming that content. What is your definition of free? Have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.